Morning everybody, Richard from Tillers here. Welcome to another edition of Tillers Turf Talk. Uh, today we're going to be having a look at our Arena Gold product and one or two options that we have with it. We're going to go out to the field. We may just catch a little bit of harvest on the way past. So it's a beautiful sunny day here, lots going on. Let's get out and have a look. Okay, just on the way to the Arena Gold field, I've noticed there's a bit of a big roll harvest going on. So you've got your beautiful rolls of our Golf Arena turf here. I've noticed the guys just got a little bit more to do. So let's just look over and have a quick look at the big roll harvest and just explain a little bit more, more about it as we go. So the name's pretty obvious really, big rolls. So big rolls of turf, 25 metres long, 15 square metres on a roll. So let's take a quick look at the machine working. This machine are only really as good as the operators. So we've got Brian on the tractor there, keeping amazingly straight lines. We've got Gavin controlling the depth of the soil, the length of the rolls, the two guys at the back pinning it, giving it its final preparation before it goes. Finally we've made it into our Arena Gold field here, um, beautiful crop here, the Arena Gold blend of both sort of a, a fine leaf perennial ryegrass and also sort of strong uh, slender and chewing fescue. The ryegrass gives it the durability, the strength, the quick recovery, gives it a great colour and the fescue goes there to bind it all nicely together and fill it in. Now when we seed these fields we don't just um, pick any kind of seed that's available, we pick the best that's available. So when it comes to seeding time we'll look at seed certificates, we're looking for things like purity, germination, success, but also we'll refer to our little handbook here. This is the, uh, the BSPB book, which again we can look up all the cultivars in this book and it will tell us a little bit more about the fineness of the leaf, the winter colour, the summer colour, and give us lots of information on the seed that we're going to be buying. So you can be assured when you get your Arena Gold, it's going to be the best seed that's available at the time. So this is our standard production field, mown sort of round about 20 millimetres. We're going to go off now, we're going to have a look at our Arena Gold shortcut and explain one or two of the advantages of the shortcut product itself. Okay guys, so here we are now in our Arena Gold shortcut field. Um, now I'm, I'm a past sort of course manager and one of my big frustrations with new turf was, was the growing. So we decided here at Tillers that we would introduce a shortcut. Basically it's Arena Gold managed by greenkeepers for greenkeepers. So this is mowed down to 12 to 14 mil. And as you can already see we've got a very, very fine leafed appearance. Almost looks like a tea box already. So the growing and the transition to pay is so much quicker. So there is a more intense mowing regime with this, a more intense management regime with it. But as I say, managed by greenkeepers for greenkeepers. Um, anybody going to BTME in a couple of weeks time will have some of this on the stand to look at so you'll be able to make a better comparison to the two products there. So anyway, let's practice what we preach and see if it works. Three hundred yards down the middle, perfect. Okay everybody, so that was a little insight into our Arena Golf product. It's just one of many that we grow here at Tillers. Hopefully you've got a better oversight on uh, the product itself, the different heights of cut that are available. You know, it's a great turf, uh, not just for sort of golf courses, for golf tees, for surrounds, for fairways, but also for a nice ornamental lawn. So, thanks for watching everybody. Uh, wherever you're watching this, please feel free to, to like, to subscribe, to retweet, to share. And if anybody's got any future ideas for videos, then please drop a comment. Uh, below and we'll take a look at them and we'll try and cover anything that you might wish to see. So thanks again everybody, take care and we'll catch up next week.